So let's see here. I've got Curiosity in my opening hand. I really don't. I don't know what it is, but I have been getting some terrible opening hands. We're going to Mulligan. I think I've Mulliganed every time with this deck. Um, that's not much better. I'm going to call Logos and drop my Titan mechanic. Just get a big beefy body on the board. Bat Drone is going to die. Fogify. Yay. I'm going to call Logos. I'm going to Positron Bolt. You. I'm going to assemble a mission my own guy just because I want the Amber and then Reap. Free Amber turn and killed off the Bat Drone. Using the Twin Bolt Emission that way makes me cry a little bit inside. But what can you do? Don Goozle and Fear. Interesting. He took out my control of the week from the Gong Goozle because it didn't die. But it sets me up to just call Logos again and get some creatures back on the board. Hmm. That's not... I, I don't get any Amber for that turn, so... Maybe. Shadows. Bait and Switch is not going to do him any good right here. Ghostly Hand, though, is always powerful. And discarding the Sting. Um, I am going to call Logos. Oh, I need Nerve Blast to steal one from me, of course. Reap. Reap. We will archive Drumble. Drumble is a great card to archive and keep for the future. And play a Fogify. Does not get me to check, but does put me in a decent enough board state. Having both our embers. Oh, wait. Oh, I'm an idiot. I had a tight mechanic on the flank. I just gave him a key that I shouldn't have. Oh, I'm an idiot. Okay. Well, in that case, I'm going to call Untamed. I'm going to discard this trash. Yes, it's going to wipe my board if I don't. Discard it. Play the Hunting Witch, which is going to be no good, and play the Ritual of Balance. I think my mistake with the Titan mechanics is going to cost me the game. I could have used Curiosity to kill it. And that was, would be a very different position. But, yeah, missing the Titan mechanic was giving him a cheaper key. It was very, very costly. And, wow. So... <laughs> <laughs> um, that happened. I I do not know what to do. Um, I really screwed up with that Titan mechanic. And it's probably going to cost me this game. I'm just... I'm going to call this and I'm going to cycle through some cards. Now I don't want to pick up my archive. Play out the key to this. Discard the hand of this. Is there anything I would be willing to take a chain for? No. Discard the Arise. I, I am in a world of hurt right now. Oh, and a Dust Imp. Um... He handed this as himself. And I'm going to call Untamed. I uh, will not be picking up my archive. I will use this stupid thing to steal one. Yay. I will... 
take my Amber. I'm giving him an Urchin back. That hurts. That hurts a lot. I will regrowth my Hunting Witch. And then play my Hunting Witch. And then play my Dew Fairy. I am sad to have given him back a Urchin that will come back to haunt me. This, Last of Broken Dreams, and the Terror. Well, in that case, I'll call Untamed again. Do I want to take my archive into my hand? No, I do not. This actually may be a slight mistake, because I'm going to gain so much Amber here, and he's going to bait and switch me. And I know it. I should have called this and put myself at exactly six. Yeah, uh, that was a mistake. Hit me with VNS. Oh no, too much to protect the other way. That's even worse. Oh, and Magda. And Urchin. Um, what can I do here? I mean, seriously. If I had some way to protect Drumble, maybe. I would have to really protect Drumble. It's six. Maybe. Maybe he won't see it. I mean, this is what I have to do. I don't want to have any shot here. I play Drumble on the right. Play Toxin on the left. Keep Drumble free from a hand of this. Play that thing. Play the Dominator Bobble. And... I have exactly one creature in my discard. I am not arising for one creature. I will hold on to the arise though, because if he kills the drumble, I can arise the drumble back. End my turn. That drumble is going to get played potentially three or four times this game. I'm not sure, but we'll see. Yeah, calling Untamed there instead of calling Dis was a huge mistake. It put so much Ember into play on his side. If it calls Dis, means she's going to Lash of Broken Dreams. Hooray, hooray. And kill the Hunting Witch. Interesting. That's what he should have done. And then he fears Drumble. Okay, so I now am forced to call this. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, I have to call this. Can't not call this. We're going to play Drumble out again. On the right. Now we can play the Terror. On the left, I keep Drumble off of the inner part of the board because he could, he has Dis, so he could hand of Dis him. I will reap with Toxin, see what I discard. Carlo Phantom, awesome. And I will use the Dominator Bobble to reap with the Dew Fairy, gaining two. And I have no humans in play to Sacrificial Altar because he murdered it. And I will. Uh, in my turn there. Yes, I want to end my turn there. He calls this. He'll be throwing two creatures at Drumble. I have very little doubt about that. 
Oh, he'll play his own drum bowl. Even better. Fights drum bowl. Fights drum bowl. Oh my goodness, this is going to get crazy. I wish this deck had a phase shift. <laughs> Makes my keys more expensive. Fine. Um, I will call this. I will use this guy. Reap with him. I will reap with Toxin. Come on, discard something good. Eh, the Archivist. I will reap with the Terror. I will blow up the board. I will arise on this. I will play Drumble. Capturing everything. I will then play the Terror. Gaining two. And then I will play Toxic on, and this is important, the left. I am now at 19 Amber. Okay, I forged my first key. I've caught up one key. This is important. Now, I have a couple of options. Oh, tough options. Mm, very tough. If I had a key cheat, this would be a much easier choice. But right now, with his board state, I think I call Untamed. It's painful for me to call Untamed. Ah, I, could call, I could wipe his board with Logos. I'm calling Logos. I, it's a, it may not be the right play, but my Drumble lives. Play Library Access. I play Twin Bolt Emission here and here. Done. I play my Anomaly Exploiter. And I play my Positron Bolt. Wiping his board. And then I'll put Rocket Boots on Toxin. And that's all I can do. Check. <laughs> The reason that Untamed might have been the better play was it would put the Witch of the Eye on the board. And with that, I can get Drumble back over and over and over again. Bat Drone, Dexter, I forge my second key. Now, Untamed looks a whole heck of a lot better. Um, this also isn't bad, but I've got to think that untamed is the way to go <laughs> is it though i mean i can kill off bat drone and the analyst oh that's tough So if I call Untamed, I'm letting him kill Drumble. Because that's just a thing that will happen. In Logos, though, what else does Logos have that can push me off of forging a key at that much Amber? Um, no, I think I'd rather play it safer. Yeah, I'm going to call this, and I'm going to off a lot of his board, I think. Oh, it's so tough. I mean, I get so much amber. 
uh, which the eye lets me get Jumble back with the Dominator Bobble. He could kill off all three with Logos, and then if he's got something, yeah, I gotta call. I gotta call this. Right. Yes. You go and fight Bat Drone. You fight the Analyst. You live. This is important. And then you can... I could kill Dexter. You reap, make him discard an Urchin. End my turn there. I'm at nine, so if he calls Dis, he's got to be able to steal one with the Schuler. I think Schuler's the only discard that would let him proactively steal one. If he calls anything else, he has to steal three. Could have an effervescent principle. He, in fact, I think he does have an effervescent. Good game, Ugluck. That too much to protect was ridiculous. But I was able to keep Drumble alive and keep Drumble alive and keep Drumble alive. Oh, that was. I was about to write that game off, but there you can see the power of Drumble. Wow. Um, sorry, I see that people have been talking to me out in the uh, Twitch channel. Uh. Oh, so Neo just is Keyforge popular or is it dying? I can't speak to that. I can speak to the number of people we have showing up on the Keyforge event tournaments. Um, but I don't have a local game store that I can go to to speak of. And that's a problem. So I can't really tell you how good it is in terms of the general community. I know that the Vault event, or the Vault Tour events, have been basically sold out tournament affairs. So, and there is a second set on the, on the way that could breathe some life into the game. But one way or the other, I, I think it's doing well. Uh, but 